Hello my friends and welcome back to our continued plan let's play Secret of Evermore with guidance and assistance from the King of Giant Robots, our dear friend Asapa. It's your boy here to bite all the baddies and sniff out all the secrets of Evermore. Indeed my friends and we are streaming on Twitch and then uploading this to YouTube and it's been a lot of fun. I'm having a lot of fun. Let's not waste any time. Let's jump back into it, shall we? So in between this moment and a previous moment, uh, we found ourselves at a game breaking bug. And I don't mean the bug that that bites you in the cave. This is a bug that apparently occurs when I, I don't know. I mean, apparently the, the thing you discovered was you go into the Northwest one uh, last. And that's what causes yeah. the bug, but we but didn't go in the northwest much, one, right? Right. So it just decided it was going to be bugged anyway. So what I had to do was I had to replay from our last heart save, which was before we met Oglin in the forest and before the boss fight of the dragon and before the sewers. So I basically worked my way through that. I got back here and I decided since I was rendering a video and I had some time... Uh, I decided to just go ahead and uh, level up my spear to max level. Very nice. It's, uh, and then I stopped. So I basically killed a lot of slimes. <laughs> yeah. Strong enough for a knight, but pH balanced for a flightless bird. <laughs> there were a lot of slimes that died um, during this time period. Uh, but yeah, I didn't really grind or anything for other okay. things. I just got my spear upgrade Word. and if we go up this way we can finally continue yay which is important and we still have our spear out and we're in a town but we're in a town we can't go inside anywhere except for two buildings well, feel free to explore the market will be back there later Oh, and In another thing I did find out is if you set your dog to search only, he will never attack. Yep. Which is fantastic because if you're trying to level up your if you're trying to level up your um your weapon. I was holding down R like this and killing things before. I don't right. need to do that. I just send him to full search and I never need to worry about having to hold the R button now. Okay, so this is like a more dreary version of the other town we were in. Or you could maybe say dirty. Perhaps. The the real people. How's that? Is there anything in uh I like, am I wasting my time searching? No. Because you can go inside the inn. But I want you to kinda go up slowly. Go up a little more, a little more, a little more. Keep creeping. Oh, he's not over there. Okay, I want you to go out and go in the other door. Doing something very deliberate. Creep up a little bit. A little more. You want to see the shopkeeper, and I want you to try to look at the shopkeeper's sprite before he starts talking. I think these things are about to shoot. No, you're safe. Okay. Look at him. Yeah. Do you, can, can you identify him as he is right then and there? No. I couldn't either. I thought he was an alien. He looks like but, he's wearing like some lordly robes or something. 
I mean, technically, he is an alien. What have we here? You're not from Evan Keeper Ivor Tower, as far as I can tell. No, we're from Podunk. Can't say I've heard of Podunk. Maybe you've heard of me. The name's Cecil of Baron Castle. Heard about my victory over Zeromus? Wait, 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 Okay, so we had a Final Fantasy VI reference, now we have a Final Fantasy IV reference? White. Hey, he's got this silver hair at least. Now... Sure, of course. Do you want Do you want to drop the safe state and get more, more t dialogue out of him? Oh, heck yeah, that's a good idea. Okay, so you're going to want to drop a safe state. Because there's a benefit to answering now, and then there's no benefit to saying can't say that I have. No, you don't know him. So which one do I want to say in the end? Uh, in the end, you want to say sure, of course. So I want to say this one first. Yes, for now. Can't say I have. How about the time I turned into a paladin? Doesn't ring a bell. How about my adventure on the moon? I don't think so. Well, suffice it to say, I've been almost everywhere and done almost everything. Now I've settled down my wife Rosa, <laughs> we live a quiet life here in Ebon Keep. Is all now this you can reload. Yours? Now I can reload? Yes. Okay. So now you get the benefit. Sure, of course. Hey, Steve, what's up, buddy? Massive discount. You Massive. know who he is, so he's going to give you a huge discount. Is all this army yours? Yes, this is my business. I sell items I've accumulated over the years. It's nice, but business has been slow lately, what with most people leaving for Ivor Tower. Why don't you leave too? Just stubborn, I guess. Didn't feel right about it. Still don't. But you seem like a nice kid. You're never going to get anywhere with that chintzy armor. Let me sit you up in style. Since you've heard of my adventures, I feel like we're old friends, so I'll give you a special deal. Hey, how about that? Alright, uh, so... Uh, hey, we're can... still using the same money, right? Yes, you're still using uh, gold coins. Okay, cool. Buy items. And it'll, bring, it'll, and it'll give you new armor to buy. It's kind of cool how we had a Final Fantasy VI reference, and now we have a Final Fantasy IV reference. Hey, Ryudo, what's up, man? How you doing today? Ryudo knows that guy. Ah! Oop. That's okay, you can sell it, Matt. Mission to me, let's take this powerful weapon as my, with my thanks. We are doing well, my friends. I found it on one well of my too. adventures. In the jungle on the plateau. See the bazooka? Thunderball projected? How many shots do I have with the bazooka now? Uh, until you buy ammo, you get one shot. So save it for a good moment. Or spend it, it's whatever. <laughs> you... I, I will tell you about the advantage later when it matters more. Hey, yeah, I, I, I like how there's both a um, there's both a Final Fantasy VI reference in the game and a Final Fantasy IV reference. I think that's awesome. Especially since I played both Final Fantasy IV and VI on the channel. <laughs> oh, uh, I need to sell the other. Color. All right. Uh, thanks, Cecil. Talk to you later. And and I think yeah, there's a box you can Wait, grab. That. He's over here now. He's over there now. He cast warp. I'm having the business on both sides because the lack of people. Take a nap. So I was one screen transition basically away from a save. When hit with that green crippling bug. Bugged. Good old bug. And that's why it's important to drop hard saves. Even yep. when you have save states. 
Alright, and now we can continue through the city, but you can't get to any other doors yet. Oh, wow. You, yeah, you automatically it. equipped it. You have one shot. Go to your weapons. Oh, that looks cool. The lance looks different. Like it looks like a like it looks like the lance spell, but it when you equip it, it's just a golden spear. Yeah. Yeah. Speaking of which, I really need ingredients. Which you're not gonna help with. I don't know why I went back in. Don't grab these yet, but you can talk to the lady. Alchemy is all but dried up. I'm thinking of retiring. You're such a cutie. Let me teach you a useful formula. Price one acorn and two water. How about that? I discovered a uh, a formula. With that, you tell me about the door. Because it was, it's the same on the other side. You've been there. Yeah, I'll still. And, and this is regen. Uh, where do you see regen at? Uh, it's it's called regrowth. regrowth. But the effect is regen. But it does require water, which is the same as heal. Yes. So I'd much rather just have two heals in a regen. I know regen That's is valid. good, but I'd much rather just be able to heal if you... Right. More importantly, I care about your ingredients. Acorns are expensive. I don't even know if that's the um the thing I need. Uh what acorns are what you needed lances. for. Lance is... Uh, I forget. And crushes. I think it's iron and something else. How do I see the... You can go into um, your um, the alchemy symbol. Uh, crushes, limestone. Uh, Lance is... Yeah, iron and acorns. Oh, okay. You did need acorns. Yeah, but I need metal too. Well, that will come later. Alright, and don't touch these? Uh, yeah, don't touch them for now. I think they act... something... If you grab things in the wrong order before people come back, this alley... Uh, so, some other stuff gets blocked off. But now we can head up into the castle. Do you ever play Final Fantasy XII? Zeva. Huh? Do you ever play Final Fantasy XII? The very beginning of it. Yeah, I didn't play that. I, I ended up. I did play the game, but I never beat it because I got bogged down in side quests. But one of the items is a Zodiac Spear. And in order to get a Zodiac Spear, you had to not pick up four very specific chests. Right. And it's, it's the not, most. Yeah. It's the most WTF thing. Ever, because there's no way you would know not to pick up those four chests. Now, get ready. You are soon to engage in a long-range combat where you cannot stab anything, but you can throw. Oh, I got a weapon for that. Yes. But it's right across. It was sooner than I expected. Also, he hits you with really hard alchemy, so don't play around. I'm a king of rats, I tell you, a king of the rats. <laughs> I'm claiming this castle in the name of disease, king and vermin everywhere. This guy looks cool. Prepare to be plagued. Yeah, so don't play around with him. Does it look like I'm playing around with him? Nope, I'm just, mm -hmm. you know, the, the fair notice, don't play.
Nice, nice. He went boom. <laughs> he just went boom. Yep, you hit him with D flash water. We literally crushed that rat. Now, had you skipped Cecil, had you skipped Cecil and came here and beat the rat, when you go back to Cecil and you buy something from him, he'll give you the bazooka with no ammo. Huh. So, do I continue on here or do I go back to the village? Oh, no, you, go, you continue on here. You haven't run into anybody yet. But it does kind of auto walk you where you need to go, I think. Wow, this place is just like the other castle, only not quite as clean. Halt! Stop! Wait! Who are you? What do you want? Hi, I'm Flat. This is my dog, Zappa. Uh, we've been sitting here by the Queen of Ivor Tower. She wants us to open the drawbridge. That imposter sent you here, and she wants you to open our drawbridge? Oh, no, 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 this won't do, this won't do at all. We can't have that. No, 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 no. Please, please, I implore you, before you do anything brash, come, come with me, come, come, come. Come now. You must, there is someone that you must meet. Yes, 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 must, must, must. So are we gonna meet the other queen? He's a real queen? Yes. You doing the voice? Yeah, just a second. I was trying to double check something. <laughs> Please follow these stairs and speak to our highness. Yes, yes, go, go, go. Up the stairs, go. <laughs> queen Blue Garden? What are you doing here? Have we met? Yeah, in Ivor Tower, don't you remember? Oh, no, no. You've met the imposter, my evil twin. Wow, this is like what happens in the two Dr. Ides. Ids. 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 Something. We find evil twins everywhere. First, it was Fire Eyes, or Elizabeth and her evil twin, then Horace, and now, you. Elizabeth, Horace, oh, you've met the others. Are you from Podunk too? Oh, 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 yes. And you were part of an experiment of a uh, mansion on the hill? You know, every single time I think of a mansion on the hill and experiments, my mind goes to Maniac Mansion. Oh, yes. And something went terribly wrong. Yes, and I've been stuck here ever since. Hasn't been that bad until a few months ago, anyway. That's when my twin appeared and locked me in the dungeon and took my place. Then she present. Then she presented the king with a hypnotic puppet show and sent him into a trance. Sorry, it's kind of confusing when someone's speaking. With the king and his couch potato state, the imposter could scheme right under his nose. By the time I got out of the dungeon, she removed the kingdom across the ravine. Oh, now there's only a few of us left in Ebon Keep. She sent us here to open the drawbridge so that her troops could clear out the castle. Oh, that's not good at all. No, no, no. It's only a matter of time before she storms in here, with or without your help. Listen, kid, I think that Tika can help you get back to Podunk. But first, you're going to have to get rid of that imposter. We'll batten down the hatches here. And we'll go back to the castle and set things straight before she can cross over. 
Sounds like a good idea. You need my help out in the field. You can call me by using one of your coal beads. Before you leave, make sure you talk to Tinker in the chamber to the east. He'll be able to help you on your journey. Thanks, Queen Blue Garden. Oh, please, call me Camellia. Alright. So now we can go down, go through the door that Tinker went through. We come down here to get back to Newcastle and confront the impossible. While you're going, we'll back down the hatches here before you leave. Make sure you talk to Tinker. His chamber is directly east of here. Right. There's nothing in this room. Okay. There so are no things. So we need to go east? Yes. Wow, what cool windows. Pictures seem almost alive. You know, I just realized where I've seen those dinosaurs from. Oh? Chrono Trigger! They do look like the, the, the anteater driller thingies. Yeah. Must be a trick of the light. What is it, Zappa? What's wrong? Not a trick. You take him out? Hmm? I miss. Well, well, sometimes. Take turns killing. That's how we work. We're a team. Oh, there's two of them. Yep. Well, that was kind of too easy to call the mini boss. Ooh, these guys were a pain in the glass. Oh my god, the puns. Wow, look at this place. Did the dog really just what... walk all the way around when he could just walk down the steps? Almost every time, it's almost like you're supposed to walk in from the top stairs. So the dog walks in from the top stairs. <laughs> uh, hello again, friend. I just ran into the security measure in the hall didn't give me too much trouble. I'm going to introduce myself. My name is Tinker Tinderbox. I deal with scientific matters, mechanical inventions, alchemy formulas. I trust the Queen of Soldier about her imposter in Ivor Tower. Yeah, we've been encountering evil twins ever since we left Podunk. Oh, you're, you're from the same place that our Queen hails from. Yeah, and there's an abandoned mansion just outside of town. Zappa chased a cat into the old place and I followed him. Cat wasn't there anymore, but we did find a strange machine in an old laboratory. What's like the ultimate villain of this game? Be like the cat that the dog chased at the beginning of the game. Hmm. <laughs> Wouldn't that be something? <laughs> the machine zapped us to another lab that looked a lot like this one. Only this lab was in some sort of space station. There were two people there. One was a scientist, Dr. Ruffelberg. The other one looked like it may have been his butler. I'm not really sure what happened after that, but we ended up on Evermore. And we've been here ever since. I think I know this place in space that you speak of. I see it through my telescope. If you want to go back to Podunk, uh, you'll probably find the way up there. And I think I know I can get you there too, yes! But first, we have to manage the hand of the imposter. The Queen wants us to go back to Ivor Tower and stop her twin from causing more trouble. That sounds like a good idea. The imposter is scheming at this very moment! Take a look! Oh 
of orders from above, Erroneo. We had to find out in a device that produces a special kind of energy. It is somewhere here in the k k kingdom, but there's no specific information about its whereabouts. My superiors ordered me to do whatever it takes to find it. Her superior? Hmm. Even if we must tear the kingdom apart, piece by piece. But, Your Highness, will this assistance be suspicious? I'll deal with those cretins when the time comes. Now, let's find that device. Okay. Wow, she's mean. Yes, she has to be dealt with in a hurry. Passing the chessboard would not be a good idea at this point. No, 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 her troops will be expecting it. Wow, so it sucked to backtrack all the way there. I recommend you go not to visit my brother, Gobi. To will help you out. Go to the dungeon sewer and then out. You'll find a block passage to the north. Near the passage is my axe. You'll find it in my chest chest. Okay, so we're not going through the locked door. We're going through the sewage areas that we couldn't go through before. Yes. Wanna buy swath? Hey look, there's your iron. Plenty of it. Stock up, my boy! Come back, I've been dispatched the imposter. I'll help you return to that space place. Cool. So, there are things to find here. Check your bookshelves. Counting on you, counting on you. Get that barrier and my axe. I just want to make sure he didn't say anything different. Not really. He phrases it different, but it's all the same data. So that bookshelf. This should come in handy. Yeah. Slow burn. So Gradually drain a target's HP. It's, it's, you know, fire-based poison. Yeah, but it also is the same thing that wine suit is. And you're fiery. Or whatever, f yeah, firepower. Yeah. Although feathers are really expensive and hard to find. Mm-hmm. One part iron, one part brimstone. Heavy. Uh, there's more stuff further down. What is with the gravity where you come from? Why is everything so heavy? Expression, go, go down and to the left. The other side. Okay, so. Oh, I didn't mean to talk to you again. I didn't mean to talk to you. You find your axe. There we go. Night Basher. It does look cool with the green. Hello. Explosion. Ah, oh, but it requires two parts ethanol, which means it's probably gonna be harder to use. But then firepower is hard to use. Wait, this isn't an attack spell, is it? Sorry. Is this an attack spell? Or is this just a... It's an attack spell. Okay, because it says destroys barriers. I mean, it might work on barriers too, in case you don't want to use to X, but... It, it is an offensive spell. Is it better than, um, Fireball? Zappa flips through his book. Um, sorry, I'm also looking at spam numbers calling me back to back. It's distracting. Um, hmm. Because if I had infinite money, firepower would be what I use, but I don't have infinite money, and feathers are expensive. So. Right. 
Uh, book, the book also says blasts barriers. So this means it's not off to the book. It's off to a wiki. Well, I guess I try it out and see how it works. It says here that requires uh, two parts ethanol, one part ash. Um, though is again the two parts ethanol it means you go through it very very quickly so do i get those treasure chests now or do i wait until later uh, uh you can there's a lot of chests in the in the <laughs> castle here to raid if you go off to the left I was talking more about the town, but okay. Uh, they're not available yet. Explosion deals heavy damage to a target after a brief delay. It's one of the most powerful alchemy formulas in the game in terms of pure offensive power. Only firepower and nitro have higher damage while lightning storm matches it. The ingredients are also plentiful by the time the player acquires it. Uh, although the although the alchemy which destroys barriers, which would imply it destroys certain barriers like stone walls, it actually cannot target them and cannot be used to destroy them. That's weird. Apparently, there's a, a, a list of potentially unobtainable formulas. Hmm. Well, there's some that you know are hidden away, like in secret areas. And you did you grab you grab the night basher, right? Yes. Okay, we got an explosion. Hold on, go back to that room. Well, you actually don't want to go up through there. Did did you go? <clears throat> Sorry, no, didn't want to do that. That was rude. Did you what? Clearing my throat right into the microphone. Now, if we go to the right from here. Trying to level up the new spell. Right. If right you go down. Here. Yeah. And now drop a safe state before you talk to this punk. Okay. Uh, safe state drop. There you go. I am there, the smartest one in have been keep. Bet you're not as smart as me. Guess the number of marbles in my hand, I'll give you something. Uh, eight. Wrong. That's what happened to me playing with the smartest boy in Ebon Keep. So you can talk to him again after a few minutes. Or tell him to bugger off. Yes. So, allegedly, and I, I looked into this once. Oh, there we go. Both heroes it, HP? What does that mean, both heroes? It, it automatically targets both. Oh, I don't need that. Like, you can't single target. It's double target. One minute age things. What if he has, um... So, if you come back later to talk to him, he he does switch his age. He will become an old man. Oh, because he worked on the spell. Right. Well, that's clever. I like and that. And then he will he will go back and forth. But if you fail the first time, you just can't get anything out of him for like a few minutes. Do some screen transitions. Come back later. Do it again. This room is clear. So is everything cleared in this area? Uh, in this room, yes. There's a little bit more. Where? Uh, back out towards the beginning. So down, down from here. And then down and veer towards the center. And then that stairway that goes down, that was in the middle here, there's a room down there. 
stairway that goes over here? Not those. Those are like blind paths that just lead you to the side entrance of the castle and kind of lame. Down there, though. Parts brimstone, three feathers, wow. Two acorns, any hidden passages here? Nothing. All right, anything else in this area? No, you are now clear to go back to the city, which means you have to go back through the city, back to the sewers. But now we have the, um, now we have the ax, so we can clear those areas, right? Right. Um, wrong way. No, I know, Unless but you... oh, okay, I, I wanted okay. to see if I could uh, restore my explosion magic. Yes, yes, yes. Resupply. I think it shouldn't be too hard just to go back here and pick up more stuff. So we are we are uh, heading back to the sewer, and then in the sewer we're going to use the axe to clear those obstructions that we couldn't get past before. Correct? Right. It shouldn't take that long. Uh, it would be nice to give me the key to the that locked door. Whatever that does. I don't think it goes to anything. I have no idea how much uh, money rats give, but... I'm trying to clean up this city. You know what I could do? And ignore that, those chests where that woman was, right? Right, for now. I think it's down this way. Yep, behind that building. Nope, go back. There you go. That's weird, my weapon is not anymore. Because this place is safe? I mean, wait, hold on. Don't tell me. Don't tell me we, we could have gone through the sewer door now. I don't know. Probably not. We should be able to later, though. So from here... Oh yeah, you would be able to pop your axe out so you can hit things when you get to the barriers. Down. Right, what's the best uh, way to go through here? Go down. Follow this around. And then stay going down. Just follow the bottom path. Less twists and turns and directions. Just follow this path until it splits upward. Oh, he said no. Need these slimes. Up from here. Bring here. out your new axe. Yep. Bring out your new toy! It's not green anymore. Go up. Like yellow. Keep going up. Keep going up. I 
and then go a little bit, and we're there. Huzzah. That was easy. And now we're here, and you can break those barriers. Don't. Not yet. Yeah, I, I just saw that. That's nice. I don't make you go through the forest again. Alright. Domi Tower. It begins. Large this map a little bit. No. Level up both my spell and my character. Yep, hold on. You want to pick up alchemy spots? You might find some more feathers. Sure. Uh, just to the, like, just above where you were at. There's one around there. Oh. We go back a bit. I think there's one up against a wall here. Go back down. Back Talk. down that way. Yep. Is thing. And then somewhere along that, the the center post that's right above you. Acorns. Can't, can't have any more acorn, which means you got to spend something that that uses acorns. I'll just spend things as I go. Yep. Okay, so... So, right along this wall that you're coming up against. Somewhere in that little corner that you're right around. Perfect. <laughs> now, somewhere, I think, along the stair- or that pu that pillar? Next to the stairs. Somewhere around that. Pixel hunting! I don't even see my dog sniffing anything. Huh. It's a different pillar. Maybe. I'm, I'm looking at a very tiny map. And my dog doesn't spell anything in this area. Ah. Uh, that's fine then. That could very well be that I'm misinterpreting this map. No worries. It's all good, dude. Yeah. And it's, it's just alchemy ingredients. Okay, I found something here. Acorns? Maybe that was it. I think I had a dead end. Oh, no, I'm, I was looking at the wrong spot completely. Alright, yeah, that is kind of a dead end. I think I looked away at the map and didn't see which way you went. So I need to go right here. Chest up there. And I just fell. And that. It's a chest there, too. That bucket, though. That barrel there should have a thing. Go back. Two mushrooms. I already got it. Oh, oh you did. Okay. So, somewhere around that stack of barrels. Oh, come on, game. Why didn't it let me Stop. go across the first time? Don't... So did I go down here? Um, no, because that's back to the beginning now. I mean, like, all the platforms have fallen apart. I can't go across them. Again. What are we doing, game? This is really getting annoying. The barrel. Oh. Okay. 
and then somewhere along that back wall. Oh, he's okay. on the the left edge there, that left corner. I have my lefts and rights correct today. Yep. Um, go back a little bit to the left and up along the upper edge. And yeah, right around there. Probably a little more to the right. Yep. Oh, feathers. Hell yeah, nice. feathers. And there's a sniff spot just barely off on the bottom edge. Corner. Right, probably right around there. Perfect. So that's an elevator, kind of. This door. So if you want to get stuff, you're gonna to have to go back down. Yeah, I was thinking that myself. So there's stuff to the left. That's the only way you're gonna get over that way. Uh, so that box, okay, a feather, beak. I'm not cool. sure where it is. So try. Uh, can you get to that little sliver of bridge? Nice. Okay, he's going for it. There you go. Like I'm not exactly sure what elevation that was on. There you go. More iron for your lights. I have no idea why. You've gone back to the beginning. Ah. You went down exactly each path to go back to the beginning. So how do I go back to the... Uh... That way. But you never have to cross that other bridge again, so... At least that won't be. My headphones just fell out of my ear. <laughs> It didn't go far. Okay, so I need to go back up the elevator. Yep. And then down? Uh, yes, down, down, somewhere around this, that pillar, I believe, it looks like. No, it's the next, it's the next tier down, sorry. So where the, the two windows are is where it says that there's a sniff point. But somewhere around that. He's not okay, maybe on the, on the lower edge? There he is. Got it. Nice. And then there's... Huh. Okay, well, there's that at least. So I go back and up? And on the, the, right, the right stack of crates. Thank you. Uh-huh. I got it. Yeah, no, I know. Was, I was saying uh-huh. So back up now. I don't know how to get to these other things. Uh, unless you want to fall down that broken bridge again. There is a, a sniff spot on the edge there, the right edge. What's that? Weird spot. Yep. And then straight up from here on the right edge. Now, uh, there's nothing critical in these two gourds that we're missing, so... But there are two treasure chests to be found, still. But it's all backtracking and super bad. Okay, somewhere up in that little... Okay, there we go, yeah. One of those bragging mini-bosses. Yes. There we go, two feathers. Time for dragon. Hmm. Is he a mini-boss? 
I can't talk. Yes, but you have to you have to be on that on that spot on that level. Yes. He dropped you. What? Fortunately, he will never drop you very far. Yeah, the fireball yeah. finally caught up to me. <laughs> yep. Oh, come on! I just got back up yep. here! Annoying. Come on. Th this, this, this just, this is like playing Zelda on the Super Nintendo and fighting that boss that can knock you down the hole. And then you gotta climb back up to fight the boss again, over and over and over again? Yep. Trick is to not get close to it. Well, I mean, I the, the, the screen makes it so that he goes off the screen. So I go to the left so he's on the screen and by the time I go to the left, he picks me up again. See what I mean? He keeps going off screen. Then let him come back. Don't chase him if he's going to just go grab, meet you there and grab you. He'll come back. <sighs> okay, that's an interesting dragon. Wait, stop, stop. The fun is fun, but I don't want to see anyone get hurt. Oh, full heal. Uh, thanks. My name's Gomi, son. I'm a junk collector and a friend of the dragons. It's my latest attempt at the great Gomi Tower. It's going to be fabulous. You may ask Gomi, why would you build such a tall tower? Aren't you happy being bound to the ground? Don't you think you'd do something better with your time? To that I say no! I am a child of the sky and I want to reach higher like my friends, the dragons. So what brings you up my structure? We heard that this is the best way to get to Ivor Tower. Oh, you don't want to go there. That queen acts so nice and friendly, <laughs> but she's really very mean and devious. That's why we're going there. My dog and I are trying to stop her from tearing apart the kingdom. Tinker told us that you could show the way. Tinker? My brother Tinker? Oh, why didn't she say that she sent you? Of course I'll help. Here's an alchemy formula I learned in my own adventures in the clouds. I call it Lightning Storm. That sounds amazing. Although it requires two parts. Ash and one iron. Which is already stuff you're using for Crush and Lance. And Explosion. Well, Crush is Limestone and Oh, wait. Wax. I keep thinking Crush is Ash. But Explosion but, and Lance are already using those. Yeah. I really like this spell. It's just... <sighs> Your call, homie. Hardball's just kind of sitting there not doing anything. Well, the problem is I would have to level it up for it to be useful. But then I would be taken away from Lance. And I would be taken away from explosion. Yep. This is the crisis of alchemy. 
you get stronger spells. But well, you be, also still have to level them up, and, and be, they share uses. And wouldn't be such a problem if it was a one to one ratio, but being a two to one ratio makes it less. Oh, just wait till you get to the ones that use a three to one. Thanks. So, uh, how do we get to Ivory Tower from here? That's no problem at all. Sterling, come here. Come on, Sterling. It was all in fun, eh? I do love how he's just picking his teeth using a spear. My friend Sterling will give us a ride. And the spear he probably got from an adventurer that he killed. Take a side one tower, okay, Sterling? Ah! Thank you, save your game. That's the second song. See you later. Oh, oh he doesn't sell you nothing. Yeah, you do. Yes, you do. Is there anything down here? Nope. Dude. Like. Dude. Thank you. All right. Um, uh, we go upward. You can switch back to your at your spear also. Yeah, I know. I was trying to do that and accidentally selected my dog. Oh. And that's why I'm going up because he kind of pulled me with him. Yep, that's the path I wanted you to take. And then you're gonna go to the left and hold up. I believe this is the right way. Yep, we're back in the castle. Which castle? Ivor Keep, the clean one. Okay, that's what I thought. So we're back uh, to come up Blue Garden. Yes. But now it's time to go watch a play. Which way? Uh, let me get my bearings. Uh, go. Uh, up and to the left. That way. Up the swirly stairs. And then go to the left. I'll get you, you little pest on that mangy car, car, car too. <laughs> oh, I love Scooby Doo. Oh, it's so, these guys. There are multiple targets. Yes, indeed. It's more than just those two. Yeah, well, let's take out these two first. Too many sprites on screen could crash the game. Now you need to get up on the stage. Oh, there we go. That's your target. Too many sprites. Let it resolve. Now you can go again. Maybe it's better just a single target. Wow, I can get up here. Yep. I didn't realize I could get this high up. I don't know. Uh. Too many sprites. What just happened? The game crashed. No! Oh, 
All right, it looks like we're doing this again. <laughs> yeah, at least you don't have to do too much because you went to save over the third slot, thank goodness. Okay, we are back. Uh, the game crashed and we had to run back here, but uh, we're back to uh, Mandroga here. And uh, we, we glitched something out because like a save state occurred and just weird stuff. And as Zappa said, it's probably just too many sprites on screen. By the way, I didn't know that it's at the uh, the guys over there. The See that? Yeah, he's hanging out over there. There we go. Level up for both of us. I need to get more crush formula though. Uh, you'll, you'll be able to do that in a bit. I don't believe it. You've dispatched my, my Mongola. Come closer so, so I can give you your, your just reward. Your eternal reward. <laughs> Take this little man for what you have done. Did you just try to belly flop on me? I meant to do, do that. <laughs> what the heck? She tried to give me her own crush. Look, Zappa, a gear. I'm beginning to think that queen was no lady. Mechanic, mm, mechanic, mechanical thing. Yeah, lad, take this for your troubles. Wow. Get cashed out. Follow me, I think her majesty has damaged the foundation. I'm surprised you never questioned why I kept speaking with a weird stammer. I thought you were just giving it a flare. A flare that wasn't on screen. Her voice was glitching out to let you know that she was a robot the whole time. Ah, clever. See, if I would have asked about that, would have spoiled the surprise? I wouldn't have told you. Oh, okay. <laughs> I think that's, that's you. Ooh, that was close. They've gone. Everyone's gone. They must have gone back to Evan Keep. All alone here. Gotta go, gotta go! Ah! <laughs> Alright, well, we're following him, I guess. Thank you for watching this video. Feel free to comment on what you saw and what you'd like to see next. I always love to hear your thoughts. But before we go, please remember that you matter, and you are brilliant, and you are loved, and you should always be true to yourself. Never let the world tell you any different. Much love to you from your friendly, feathered, flightless bird.